So that's a really interesting topic, actually. And I've got a couple of clients, two, three, going through that right now, um, where they are, uh, for the first time, um, bringing in a full-time MD into the business. So this is uh, typically entrepreneurs who have set up a business, grown it, built it, um, and it's reached a point where either it needs a different skill set, um, a more um, traditional management, if you like, rather than entrepreneurial management, or the entrepreneur owner has reached a point where he or she wants to go off and do, do other things with their time rather than running the business day to day. So yeah, see, see that quite frequently. And it's a really interesting topic and it's quite tricky. Um, and what I mean by that for the entrepreneur owner, um, it's often the first time that they've, they've had somebody like an MD uh, or even CEO uh, working for them. So they have to almost go off and learn a new job. And their job is to, or their job is to stop being MD and learn to go off and be the entrepreneur owner um, who's not directly necessarily involved in the day-to-day -day running of the business. So the transition can be quite hard because they feel they naturally want to be involved in everything. They naturally want to get involved in all the different decisions and and so on. Um, but they've actually got to learn to stand back uh, and let their new uh, senior team member take on those roles. So. I spend quite a bit of time with the entrepreneur actually helping them figure out what decisions they are going to make, what decisions they're not going to make, what are the uh, uh, what, what are the chains of command within the business, so who reports to who, um, at what point do things need to be escalated up to them. Um, and actually, another big topic of conversation for the entrepreneur owner is, what are they going to do with their time? Because all of a sudden, they're 40 or 50 or 60 hours a week, whatever it might be that they were working, um, they've just lost uh, or, or, or had removed from them 20 or 30 hours or 40 hours, whatever it is, of work every week. Um, and they sometimes really struggle to know what to do. So I, I, I spend time with them before the event, getting them to really think about where they want to spend their time. What are the things either within the business or out of the business that they've really wanted to do, really wanted to focus on. Rarely do I see somebody who says, yeah, I just want to walk out of the business and never get involved with it, apart from seeing the management accounts once a month. They typically have other areas within the business that they want to develop or other things that they want to get involved with. And generally, what they want to get away from is the the day-to-day -day minutiae of running the business. They like the big picture things. They like the, the, the big projects, but not the, not the detail.